<laughs> we got you now. <laughs> no, please. Please, no. No! Boss! No! <laughs> Not here. Well, let's go make an animation. Yo, yo, what is up, guys? I'm Sky, and if you're new to the channel, I'm a YouTube animator living in LA. Wait, not right now. I'm currently in Michigan visiting some family. That's why you have the whole green room vibe. Today, we're gonna make a short animation without a tablet. And I'm making this video because about two years ago, I made a video called How to Animate Without a Tablet. And still today, I still get questions on how I made this video. I shot the entire thing on my cell phone, I edited it on my cell phone, and I did the lip syncing on my cell phone as well. And this can help some of you guys out there who are kind of limited on equipment. So yeah, we are gonna animate without a tablet. Now, first thing you're gonna need to make a video like this is a script. Just write something short, something quick, something simple. Having a script is always a good idea because it gives you a plan. The last thing you wanna do is not have a plan when you're making a video. It's not good for the viewers and it's not good for the editor either. So have a plan, write a script. Next, go record the audio. Now I do recommend using an external mic, but the internal microphone on your laptop is fine. If you don't have a laptop, just use the voice recording app like I did when I made my first how to animate without a tablet video. The voice recording app works great. After you're done recording your audio, make sure you edit it down. You got all the ums and uh, the background noise. Take all that stuff out because the main thing people want to hear are the vocals. Now in this video, I'm not here to actually teach you how to edit. If you do want some tips on how to edit animations, I'll, I'll make another video about it. But for today, I'm just assuming that you guys know how to, to do basic editing. After you've written your script, recorded some audio, and then edit the audio, now you have a good idea of what the scenes are gonna look like. And that is where you can use your cell phone. Okay, audio's done recording, and you can see it all right here. Now for the animation we're gonna make today, it's all pretty much just from here to there, because it's very short. Remember, today, we're keeping it short and simple. Now to edit my audio, I use Final Cut Pro, but there are a ton of free apps out there. If you have a Mac, iMovie's great. And if you're using your cell phone to edit, Video Leap was amazing. I cannot, I'm, this is not a sponsored video. I use Video Leap to make that entire How I Animated Without a Tablet video. It's over 10 minutes and it, it was it turned out really well. So highly recommend Video Leap. In my video, what I'm gonna do is actually go out and shoot and try to get maybe four good angles. That's all I really need. I'm gonna try to shoot with my cell phone, but I ha also have backup camera. Now when you're shooting the background, you wanna have the camera as steady as possible. So if you could prop your cell phone up on something so that it doesn't move, and if you don't have anything to prop the camera up, I highly recommend shooting at a higher frame rate so that you can slow the footage down if it's too shaky. Now, enough of that. Let's go out and shoot real quick, and then we'll come right back, hop on the computer, and edit this thing. Okay, so what we are filming with, first of all, we need our mask. I'm gonna take this DJI Osmo Pocket camera and the cell phone. <laughs> How are you? I love like young filmmakers. It's inspiring, man. I'm gonna sit my stuff down and then set up for the shoot. But I think I'm gonna film right here. Okay, so I forgot to bring my stand for my phone. So I'm gonna use the Osmo Pocket since it has a stabilization on there. And I'm gonna just handhold it. So I think I get some cool shots right where he's like gonna jump off. All right, I think I'm good. I think I got the shots. Only need like four good ones. Right, now that we are back at the green room, let's take a look at what we shot outside at the park. Now we are in screen record and let's take a look at some of these shots. I've already copied and pasted these shots from the camera to the laptop just to get things going quickly. So let's take a look. So here's one. Uh, this shot's okay, and you can see it's a little, you know, it's not as stable as I would like it to be. 
The best way to do it is to have either a tripod or to prop the camera up on something and just press record. That way you, you won't get any movement and you can switch out the characters seamlessly. If you're using paper or toys, you could do it with anything, honestly. Yeah, this, so yeah, this shot right here, I probably won't use. I was thinking about having me jump down and then fly in, but yeah, I probably won't use that because I'm because I want to try to use since I don't have any paper and since I've already have the PMGs on my computer, I don't want to draw anything because the whole point of this is animate without a tablet. Okay, let's take a look at this. Was not too bad. Okay, let's go to the next one. Ah, uh, this is uh, I think this one's a little bit better. Now that we have our scenes picked out, we're ready to dig in and start recording. But before we do that, the lip syncing. Now, when I did my lip syncing, it took forever. But Adobe came through because Adobe actually has a software called Character Animate. And it comes with characters already, so you can actually turn off the characters if you just want to use the mouth, you can do that. If you just want to use the eyes, you can do that. Uh, I made mine a while back and I used the mouse from other people, but for the most part, and if you don't have a laptop, just use your cell phone and download the PNGs online. Google mouse positions or, or uh, lip sync or something like that, and you can find an entire file of just mouths that you can use and just put them into your character. Okay, now that we have the lip sync out of the way, let's let it render. And while it's rendered, I'm gonna go ahead and hop into the editing. I went ahead and go ahead and try to put like a rough together. So along with the audio for the next video. But here is what we have so far. So I finished editing the lip sync and while all that stuff is exporting and rendering, I went ahead in Final Cut Pro and edit out what I kind of want. Also, uh, there are some effects missing, but it, I think I have it. I have a pretty rough cut of what it's supposed to look like. All right, and that is done. The sketch is already edited. It's about a 44 second sketch. And the sketch is a reference to Maz and how he, he loves to play Among Us and he tweets about it all the time. So my sketch is about Maz and the Among Us. So let's take a look at it. Okay, so here is the timeline. And now it's a little bit, it's not as complicated as it looks because I grouped everything together. So if you click inside one of these you'll get everything in there okay you'll get you see you'll see the layer of the rain and it's just it's just an overlay of rain so you can find that for free I found it free on actually like I think it was a YouTube so just downloaded it from YouTube and dropped it and saved it and then dropped it into mine there we go make this a little bit bigger okay and now let's go ahead and dig into it and watch it I'll save you, Maz. Uh, what are you doing? He's the alien! Yeah, we saw him. What? Psh, you guys can't fool me. He ya! Ah uh, no! Run away! Run away! He's crazy! Alright, cool. They won't be bothering my favorite animator anymore. Ain't that right, Maz? Maz? <laughs> Maz, why? Ugh. And that is it, guys! Thanks again for watching. If you are new, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also hit that like button if you learned something. And again, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay active, keep creating, be safe, and be a boss. Go out there and make some of these animations and share them with me. I would love to see them. So go out, create, and share with me. With me. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.